welcome back to the channel so first of all just log in with your credentials like this okay now just simply scroll down and from here copy this link into the getting into the dialogflow cx just copy this link carefully do not copy that full stop copy this open the new tab and open paste over there now just scroll down here we have to just create one agent so come to your dialogflow click on this checkbox click on accept now click on this it will redirect to this page from here just choose your project id okay now just wait for a second you will get option to click on enable api just click on this click on cancel again click on this enable api just wait for a second now this thing is loading now what is happening over here sometime this loading page is gone and because of that it's stuck forever so if i face or if you face that kind of issue i will let you know what you have to do so as you can see the loading page has been gone so that time what you have to do just go to your dialog flow again click on this dialog flow cx then you will redirect to this page again now again choose your project id like this and just wait for a second let me just click on this cross and you will get the option to create an agent click on this create agent for the name copy this thing carefully okay and always copy between that inverted comma in this line so just copy that paste over here from here just choose the global option like this and simply click on create just wait for a second and your agent has been created now if you just check the score for the task this task you will get score sometimes it takes time to update a score for all the tasks in this lab so do not worry about that just keep hitting check my progress couple of times now what you have to do just copy this name of the lab go to the my telegram channel the link is link is in description box open that channel in here search bar search for the name of the lab here you can see one zip file or no not zip file dot blob file will be present just save this file to your local system now click on this agent click on this view all agent and now click on this three dot from here click on this restore then upload and select file and select your file like this click on restore just wait for a second and everything will be restored so everything has been done now what you have to do just a little change just come over here to your dashboard you just need to change your project id so just copy this project id like this come over here and if you want you can just close this step no need of this now click on this manage then click on this webhook now here you can see there are two webhooks so just click on this first one and here you can see let me just zoom in for you this project id so just make this project id make the changes with your current project id like this okay now click on save again do the same thing over here just need to make the changes of your project id please be careful with this thing and done now simply click on save so once you're done with that now simply click on test agent one more thing do not close this agent until you complete all the steps now just scroll down click on this check my progress you will get a score without any issue if you didn't get on first attempt just keep hitting on check my progress so we got a here now just scroll down to the task number six okay because there is no check my progress until the task number six now here what you have to do just copy this thing between the, this inverted comma copy this paste over here on the talk to agent you will get a one output from the agent just wait for a second okay so as you can see we got a, this kind of output and once you are get this kind of output if you just scroll down click on check my progress you will get a score without any issue do not worry about that as i said time this lab take time to update a score so, uh, add a, as, I, as you can see i got a score now again scroll down till the task number nine okay now in the task number nine in the run a test to the change different tire so just scroll down from the point number two copy this thing carefully 
between this inverted comma copy that paste over here and click enter so it's asking what the phone number you what is the phone number of your account so just copy this phone number and paste over here so you will get a, a output like your plan has been changed to the platinum service as mentioned over here and if you just scroll down click on check my progress you will get a score without any issue okay now scroll down till the task number 11 now here please pay attention this task is very tricky so let me just zoom in over here okay so that you can just see carefully first of all copy from this inverted comma between this inverted comma like this copy this and paste over here okay so once i paste it's i am getting output like your pin has been changed which is mentioned over here also so no need to make any other changes now from this three we have to just pay attention copy this thing carefully paste over here okay so what i what out, output i have got what is what should your last name for that just copy this thing carefully and again paste over here and once you paste this you can see the last name of on the account has been changed and as you can see this our output we expected now do the same thing over here copy that from inverted comma and paste over here again it's asking what is the first name you should on your account so just copy this thing and paste over here so okay and you you got it you are got this kind of output which are mentioned over here now copy this last thing carefully and paste and you will get this kind of output and once you are getting this kind of output that's mean you are done with the lab if you are not getting this kind of output that's mean you have made the mistake while giving the options okay so as you can see i got a score and that's the way we have to complete this lab if you still have any doubts please let me know in the comment section guys and if you like the effort which i put over here because i have performed all these steps so that we, you can complete the lab in very couple of minutes so thanks for watching if you like the video please comment down below is this helpful for you or not so thanks for watching and have a good day